every one of us gets stuck at some point in the spiritual life. Sometimes we even get burned out trying to please God. We can't live the Christian life alone, nor does God want us to. The Holy Spirit is referred to in the sacred scriptures as living water, a mighty wind, such as at Pentecost, or roaring waters, which demonstrates his power. Invite the Holy Spirit in. Ask for a fuller outpouring in your life, a new Pentecost on this, the Feast of Pentecost. Allow his mighty wind to move you, his roaring waters to rush through you with its refreshment and surging strength that you might accomplish the works that God has for you to do for his people. Allow his living water to well up within you to eternal life, giving you joy that never ends. God only wants to give good gifts to his children, specifically the gift of the Holy Spirit to those who ask. So let us ask together as we pray. Come, Holy Spirit, fill us with your love and the power you demonstrated on Pentecost. Let us and the whole world today experience a new and profoundly powerful Pentecost. We pray in the mighty name of Jesus our Lord. Amen. Thanks for joining us. Hopefully these nine days have given you a new sense of joy of the Holy Spirit, the true mark of the Christian and a sense of hope in the person of the Holy Spirit, who is the first installment of eternal life. If you found this series helpful, please like it and share it with those that you love, and subscribe to our channel by pressing the bell. God bless you.